Hello, I am Flash Isaac. This is Flash Ninas. You are now watching 120 Days to Jam. This is a series containing 120 videos to prepare you for jam. Each episode of the series contains introduction, outline, detailed class, questions, and homework for you. The questions and homework are from the Flash Learners Jam application. Install Flash Learners Jam app today to access all the free features. Click activate and scroll to buy activation key to get access to the golden features. Don't be scared, the app is affordable. Do you have trust issues? Simply chat me directly on Facebook, WhatsApp, Instagram, and Telegram for installation and activation instruction. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time to take off. This is episode number 9 of the 120 Days to Jam Economics with Flash Isaac. In this episode, we shall be looking at questions on their tables, charts, and graphs. The first question we are having here says, of course, from the Flash Learners Jam application. Ensure to get one for yourself. It is the best and most advanced app for you to pass Jam UTME. What is the highest sectoral angle of the sector? What is the highest sectoral angle of the sector? Now, are you confused by the question or by the English? Or both. Remember, I told you that pie chart is something like this. So circle broken down into various parts, and each of the parts is referred to as sector. Sector. Now, if you have something like this. This is sector 1, sector 2, sector 3. By inspection, which do you think is the biggest or the largest sector? Sector 1, obviously. Now, we are using this table to answer the question below. What is the highest sectoral angle of the sector? It means, from this table, get a pie chart, then find the part that carries the biggest angle. Biggest angle. That is the simple English. What do we have in the table? We have sector. Health sector, education sector, housing sector, manufacturing sector, and agricultural sector. And the amount on agricultural se health sector is 30 million naira. Education, 25 million naira. Housing, 15 million naira. Manufacturing, 10 million naira. And agriculture, 20 million naira. What we should do is to convert all the amount to degrees. Amount to degrees. So, to, uh, to convert amount to degrees, for a particular item, we say amount of item over total amount times 360 degrees. To convert to degrees, you must multiply by 360 degrees. If you are converting percentage to degrees, the particular percent of the item over the total percentage possible, which is 100 times 360 degrees. Now, if you are converting health sector to degrees, health sector will simply be the amount in health sector, that is 30 million, let's use 30, over total amount. Total amount is 30 plus 25 plus 15 plus 10 
plus 20. If I am correct, this will give you 100. Ignore the million because it already uh, round up to values. We know that they are in millions. So 30 plus 25 plus 15 plus 10 plus 20 is equal 100. So the total amount is 100 times 360 degrees. So this should give you, if you want to say 30 times 360, then your answer divided by 100, very okay. If you want to say 100, 2 divided by 100 is 50, 2 divided by 30 is 15. Then you say 10 zero, cancels 10 zero here. Then you say 5 divided by 5 is 1. 15 divided by 5 is 3. Then 3 times 36. Fine. You should get 108 degrees. Anyhow, you can break this down to get 108 degrees. It is very okay for you. You need not use my pattern of solving if you have one that already works for you. Unless it needs to change. You want to change. Should if since head carries the highest amount, head will simply have the highest sectoral angle. It is very, very obvious. Head will carry the biggest angle. But let's solve for the other sectors, which isn't necessary. In this type of question, the biggest amount will carry the biggest se angle uh, sector. We carry the biggest angle. So you just look for the biggest amount, check the angle, then look for the option. But if you want to look for the angles of all the sectors, then you want to plot a pie chart. A question can come that way. We proceed. It is not difficult. So this is for health. For education, it will simply be 25 over 100 times 360. For housing, it will be 15 over 100 times 360. For manufacturing, this will be 10 over 100 times 360. For agri, 20 over 100 times 360. Now, 25 over 100 times 360 is equals. Now, these are the angles. What if you ask for the lowest sectoral angle? The lowest sectoral angle is simply manufacturing, which carries 36 degrees. If you add 108 to 90 to 54 to 36 to 72, you get 360 degrees. That shows that you are correct. So representing that in the pie chart, you simply have something like this. Since you are not doing construction, you don't have instruments, you need not be accurate. You just make sure that health is biggest. Then, how many? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3. Fine. So let's assume. So let's assume this is the biggest head, 108 degrees. Next big one, education, education, 90 degrees. Uh, agri, 72 degrees. Health, 54 degrees. Manufacturing. 36 degrees. We are not asked for any of this, but I'm doing it for you to learn so that anyhow question comes, you'll be able to solve it. The percentage contribution of agriculture is dash. The percentage contribution of agriculture. The mining sector is 30 degrees. The agricultural sector is 90 degrees. 
the oil sector is 160 degrees. So the percentage contribution of agriculture simply means convert agriculture, which is 90 degrees, to percentage. When you see questions like this, you should smile. To convert degrees to percentage, you simply say it is the degree of the item of, of the data or of the item over total degree. times 100. So if you are changing to percentage, multiply by 100. Change it to angle or degrees, multiply by 360. Our Greek is 90 degrees. So 90 degrees. Total degrees is 360, which is the total degree we can have in a circle. 3, 3 degrees times 100. This will give you 25%. Oh, 25, 25 is the same thing as 25.0. 5 is the same thing as 5.0. It is the same thing as 5.000. 0, 0 after points are immaterial. So option D is your correct option. And here it says, what is the percentage contribution of services to the national income? Services. Okay. Percentage contribution of services to the national income. When you look at this question, we are given the angle of mining to be 120 degrees, a Greek to be 72 degrees, manufacturing to be 108 degrees. Service, we are not given the angle, but we are asked to con convert the angle to percentage. The first thing we do is look for the angle of services. Let it be S degrees. If the angle of service is S degrees, we know that if you add the angle of service S degrees to the angle of mining 126 degrees and add the angle of agric, which is 72 degrees, and add manufacturing, which is 108 degrees, Everything here in this circle will give you 360 degrees. True or true? True. S degrees plus 306 degrees is equals 360 degrees. S degrees is equals 360 degrees minus 306 degrees. That is 54 degrees. Look at it. 126 degrees plus 72 degrees plus 108 degrees, that will give you 306 degrees. So S degrees plus 306 degrees is equals 360 degrees. We are looking for S degrees. We therefore take this plus 306 degrees to the other side. It is positive here. When you move it to the other side, it becomes minus. So S degrees is 360 degrees minus 306 degrees to give you 54 degrees. Now, when you get the 54 degrees, you just look at the option and see 54%. Many of you will jump. Boom! We got, boom! Correct, correct. I've key jump. You've not key jump. Jump kid you. Do you know why? This is degrees, not percent. The degree, the part was missing. So we solved to get that part to give us 54 degrees. They say find percentage. Degree is different from percentage. Nobody asks you for degree. We need the degrees for us to get the percentage. That is the reason we look for the missing degrees. So, you must relax and think. The, uh, before is degrees, not percent. To change degrees to percent, we therefore say that the contribution of service, 54 degrees, over total possible degrees in a uh, circle, 360 degrees times 100 times 100 to change to percentage and this will give you 15 percent so this answer is in percentage here is in degree if you had to add if you had asked the angle of the service sector this would have been correct degrees but you are asked for the percentage convert the angle to percentage to get 15 percent 
ladies and gentlemen, that brings us to the end of this class. For your assignment, you open the flash in that jump app, go to question search, type pie chat, answer the questions that follows. And you can answer questions by topic using the flash in that jump app. Click on any subject, any topic you wish to study, you answer questions only under that topic. So, I hope you enjoyed this episode. See you in episode 10.